Hello, and welcome to something a little different. I have made it my personal mission to find the really good hot sauces roundabout, wherever they are and wherever they are for sale on my travels. I will go and pick them up. To that extent, I've been very fortunate. Matthew Welly's habanero pepper sauce. He grows the peppers himself, makes the sauce himself. It's almost like a preserve which is great. And you can get them from Hayskin Studio. I'll put the link down below. This is the taste test. It really is air meat this time because there is no seasoning on this. It would t probably taste like fresh paper. This particular bottle was made with an extra yellow pepper. This will be my first, my, my first adventure into this specific bottle. Uh, so I want to see how this goes. It does smell like peppers. It also smells quite sweet. I want to say it smells green, but I feel like that's just a really dumb way of saying that it smells like plants. It's like when you go in the bush and you just like cup trees and stuff and then everything smells like bush. It's like a very raw nature smell, if that is a Raw sauce! Okay. Is this too much? I don't know. Hey, hmm? This is a piece of free range hand rolled chicken. I believe it was fed municipal water because there's a drought still. It's like purity. Thank it is, food. it is. To pepper lovers and sauce aficionados, this is the purity of. You see, well, I mean, you're probably going to shit that's going to look like this when you're done. <laughs> no, I have a stomach ulcer. This is what's coming out of me. Cheers. So obviously there is an immediate like attack. So you feel your mouth burning a little bit. The burn is also very gradual. So it doesn't just start burning immediately and then you lose all sensation in your mouth and all taste. It's almost sweet, but it's not sickly sweet. Like it's not, hasn't been like over sweetened. This is really nice. Yeah. Tell us what you think. Flavorful. Like there's a lot yeah, of that's flavor. Yeah, very round. Mm. A very colorful flavor despite it only being yellow. Easily top three sauces that I've had so far. You could easily put this into a pot of food, cook it in, or it would also go really nice on a sandwich or like over a steak. It's starting to get really warm now. Mine actually, I feel like it fades really quickly. The attack is there, like it's just like slow attack, but then the burn, like the burn goes with it and like sort of just keeps burning as you go. That's why I say it's very enduring. You're not going to enjoy this. Yeah. I told you. Like and subscribe, brother. Hey, Tommy. Have more. Let's have some hot sauce. This stuff tastes amazing.